All right, Devin here, and I'm with Blake. And today's video is about a really big, large walnut log. And what make it, makes it extra special is that it was transported all the way from Rio Doso, New Mexico, for us to cut here in Central Texas. I had the opportunity to film some of the cutting process, and yesterday was only my second day. So I'd never seen anything like that, and it was just a really interesting process to watch. And I imagine, hopefully not to embarrass myself too much on video that, that he was capturing. So check it out. If you like it, please subscribe to us, and we'll try to do more of these videos with some of these special logs. All right, over and out. Hey, Devin here, sitting with Brent, give you a little narration on this video. How y'all doing today? Loading a big but really strange walnut. These guys came all the way from Ruidoso, New Mexico to Dripping Springs, Texas. This log at its main crotch, normally you're used to two branches, it had five. There we go. Top one is one, and you can see four more. Is that typical of walnut? Mm. It's the weirdest walnut tree I've seen, but we all are different in life. There we go, there's our cut capacity. We trimmed it out perfect, so I thought. Until right here. Oops. So normally we can cut through a log top to bottom, no issue, but we don't get to see inside of what we're cutting soul of the tree baby and you know what a five limb crotch that's new to me and you come all the way from new mexico you're probably going to want to look inside yeah these guys were great i was excited about this you missed out brent you're not wrong man so this is obviously not a typical walnut yeah, I was, I was surprised. I mean, that's the five limbs right there with the blonde, but guess what? It's perfectly imperfect. So I jump back on the horse at this point, and I'm gonna go ahead and do it as we normally do from top to bottom. Anytime we get to throw sawdust, it's a good day. A little different angle, that's a driver's seat right there. Texting and sawmilling is not illegal, at this point at least. All right, now, normal cut would be top to bottom and that's exactly what I do from here on out. I thought everything was trimmed, dude. <laughs> Why do you call me out? <laughs> yeah, that actually would have damaged the sawmill itself because that would have, that lower limb would have definitely bent the blade. So that's why I cut it off. Oh, it would have fell on it is what you're saying. Exactly. Gotcha. All done. Hey folks, thanks for watching. If you like this, let us know. We'll make more.